Good morning. morning. Group hug. Say good morning. You wanna give them a kiss? Go. Mwah. Hey, blue kisses. Give me this. Can you give me one? Give Yay. me a kiss. Give me a kiss. Wow. I want the other kind. Give me the other give kind. Mm, thank you. So Christmas is over and we're moving towards the new year and I love Christmas, but I also love how refreshing it is to get your house back in order. And then I start looking forward to planting seeds and thinking about spring. So that's really exciting for me. A little too much indulging going on. And so I'm going to show you how I get back on track and it just makes you feel so much better. And then I fit my clothes better and I'm not gonna go buy the next size up. So, gotta hone it in. For the next 20 days, I'm starting my day off with a detox tea. I'll show you which one that is. Detox tea before coffee. And then in my coffee, I'm still doing the collagen and a little bit of coconut oil, which I actually love, and my Christmas spice. So now I have to think of a New Year concoction that I'm going to put in there, mix it up a little bit. But spices are very good for you. And so adding those actually helps to purify the blood and boost metabolism, doing all kinds of good things for you. Get on my website and check out the recipe for the Christmas spice. My favorite collagen is the one from Ancient Nutrition. I met the, the person that they get the collagen from, Jordan Rubin, and he's doing things right. Sustainable farming, those cows are eating grass, and it's coming from excellent source. This recipe is coming to you soon. New bread recipe, yummy applesauce. I have to show you this amazing Christmas gift. Look at this. So I like to travel with my water. I use the Berkey and um, now I can travel with my gallon, but I gotta be honest. And I loved all my gifts. Please understand, I loved all my gifts. I'm so thankful, but look at this. And the reason why it's my favorite. So first of all, I do a lot of air frying. I had the little new wave and it was uh, Teflon, I guess. And the bottom started peeling off. So we all know that's toxic. Well, this one, I don't have to worry about that because it's stainless steel. And I can dehydrate. So I can start dehydrating stuff at a temperature that helps to retain the nutrients. So, oh, super excited. Today for breakfast, I had the maple quinoa bowl. And you just put whatever fruit you want on top. I love to put walnuts, pecans, or almonds. And then I pour coconut milk to make it like cereal or whatever kind of milk you'd like with a drizzle of maple syrup and a little bit of cinnamon. This is my daily routine of supplements. Can I take them all at once without choking? Let's see. I cannot. That's a lot. Oh, half, half. Oh, no. Kids, don't try this at home. It's time to regroup, and I'm feeling good about it. And the old me right now would be doing a three day something extreme, like a juice cleanse or maybe just smoothies or something like that. But first of all, every night when you go to bed, your body detoxes. So if you just give enough time between the last meal and you go to bed, first of all, you're gonna sleep better. Two hour window, no more food, two hours before bed, so that your body can do what it's supposed to do, which is rest and detox. And then I'm just eating super clean because clean foods help to detox your body and your liver and your organs. And so we don't have to do things extreme. So I'll just kind of show you what that looks like. I'm out and about, I have some returns to do from Christmas and I am so hungry. So I'm gonna hit up this spot that has some healthy 
lunch options and I'll show you what I get. It's called Green Fetish. It's downtown Greenville. And I'm trying to decide if I want something warm. It's raining outside, it's kind of chilly. Or if I want a smoothie bowl. I ended up getting lentil soup and I just needed something to tide me over. I've got food at home and I just went to the grocery store. So I was like, just get me home. But I'm so hungry. And I also got a turmeric latte. So something you can easily make at home, but it's cold outside, it's raining. I wanted something to warm my soul. And it's also anti-inflammatory, very detoxifying. So turmeric is very gut healing. It helps to boost the good bacteria in the gut. It helps to lower inflammation. It is a blood purifier, a uh, wonderful thing to get in your life. And so cheers. Yeah. All right. So one of the areas that I have struggled with is this, and I'll call them saddlebags, anything in this area. So when I weighed a little bit more, this is where I would carry weight. And it is something that I need to be mindful of. So here are four moves, if this is your problem, to help target and slim those thighs. To grab my weights just for a little added weight and I'm just gonna go side to side and you can start to feel it burn and you want to repeat that do three sets of 10 each side and then the traditional fire hydrant which always gets me i'm already sore because i did a booty workout yesterday so trying to get these moves on point really targeting the side you want to do 20 each side Three sets. And then the rainbow. Come down on your elbows. And then you're just going to sweep side to side. And again, 20 each side three sets. So she's going to do the modification for us. Hey, can you do the modification for yeah. us? Okay. Cause see some people, they can't do these hard moves. And so they need to take it down a level. So are you going to be the modifier? Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Okay. So you got to get down on your side, get down on your side like this. She's just going to use the weights. We'll just let her do the weights today. She's showing arms, the arm moves. So last but not least, we're just going to lift our leg up to the side and bend and out and down and up, bend, out and down. And oh my gosh, right here, I'm already so sore from yesterday. And what you want to do is as many as you can until you feel that burn on the side, switch to the other side, repeat three times. And you will see quick results if you do these every other day. We're going to work on our form. So you're going to go on your side, put your elbow under your, you're going to put your hand under your head. Yep. Just like that. Yep. And you're going to lift your leg up to the side. Good. See, working those saddlebags. That's how we do it. That's how we do it. <laughs> Boop. This year I'm getting very serious about taking care of my body and mobility, working on mobility and flexibility because it helps with your health so much off the charts, balancing hormone levels, helping with brain power, all those amazing things. Join me. For dinner, I had made autumn chicken, which is delicious. And I can't share this recipe with you because it's actually gonna go in my recipe book for my family secrets. So you can look forward to that in the future but it's just a whole roasted chicken. And I throw in a bunch of different vegetables. Every time can be a little bit different. And there's a delicious, healthy dressing that I drizzle all over the entire thing. You just pop it in the oven for about an hour and a half. Super simple. You can also do it in the crock pot, 
but details come in later. While I am detoxing my body, must detox the face. It is time to relax. A nice Epsom salt bath. Give me a kiss. Ah! You gotta give me a kiss goodnight. Give me a kiss goodnight. Give me a kiss. Give me a kiss. Oh, Let me give you one. Mwah. I love you. I love you. I love you. Hey. Good night. Okay. Tell everybody good night. Go tell them good night. Say good night. Good night, Macy. I'm so ready for bed. I honestly can feel detoxing. I can feel the detox. I'm tired. I'm ready for bed. But it's good to know that food, nutritious food, is cleansing all on its own. We don't have to do extreme things to cleanse our body. We just need to eat fresh fruits and vegetables and stay away from highly processed foods, boxed foods, and things like that that are really harming your body. If you would like to see more, I ask if you would leave a comment. Let me know what you would like to see and um, share this with someone who maybe they're struggling with uh, clean eating or just need some support. You know, how do we do this through the day? I would really appreciate it. Good night.